Well, hi there. Thank you all for taking a moment to join me for a behind-the-scenes look at how our Hallelujah Chorus was created and mastered. Now, what you're looking at in this video is the Audacity software. And this is a free audio editing program that I used to mix all of your voices together as I received your individual recordings. As the screen is scrolling down, the purple waveforms represent your individual voices and if you look to your left you'll be able to see your name on the left hand side of the screen so you can pick yourself out now once I received each of your recordings and imported it in the vertical lines going through those purple bars are where I've either added or deleted silence or moved you forward or backward to bring you all into sync with one another you know truly putting together this piece has been a new challenge for all of us because it's such a such a different environment not only to be recording at home without a congregation to sing to but more so not to have any of your other choir family to lean on for guidance and having to synchronize your voices with only the piano track. Now, you'll notice as I scroll through that I have you all grouped, all the uh, altos, sopranos, the bassist, and of course the tenors. And what you're looking at now as I'm scrolling down is where I've mixed you down into master tracks. So I took all of our bassist, sopranos, and tenors, and um, I mixed you all into a master track once I got you synchronized, but we still weren't quite done yet. I then had to take those and do one more round of editing because in the process of getting our voices matched, we became out of sync with one another and the backing track itself. And I just wanted to take a short pause and give you all a chance to hear uh, one of the many versions that we had before we arrived at our final product. You know, I truly do appreciate each and every one of your contributions and the effort that you took to make this possible. Uh, without all of your voices, you know, truly the, the sum is greater than any one individual part. And that's really what I was trying to accomplish. And having this ideal, I was hoping to bring, uh, you know, a sense of connectedness to our choir members as we're not able to worship at home. And also to bring our voices of the choir to our congregation so they had a chance to hear us all in harmony. And I hope you all are happy with the end result. In the future, if we decide to do anything like this again, if any of us can put up with it, we've learned several lessons and there's quite a few shortcuts we can apply next time where we'll be able to get an even better end result and not have to work as hard to get there so again i appreciate all of you that contributed and your willingness to try something new and i hope you're happy with the uh, end result in the weeks to come i will try my best to splice together our video and get something better than just a simple uh, lyric background but we just simply ran out of time this week 
Feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions, and I hope you all have a wonderful week following Easter.